Hi everyone, here we have our questions. We say four unbiased dice are thrown. Find the probability that there are exactly two six, at least two six, and not more than two six. So you can see the dice here, the number of dice here is talking about is four. And what the outcome they always say is six. To get 6 on the dice, our probability is 1 out of 6. So we have P equals to 1 over 6. Q automatically will be 5 over 6 as 1 minus P equals to Q. So before we start answering the question, we write our distribution. X is number of dice getting 6 so for the first x distributed by binomial number of dice is 4 getting 6 is 1 over 6 so for the first question probability exactly 2 so number of dice is exactly 2 we can use formula Binomial formula is P PX equals to R equals to N C R P power of R Q power of N minus R. So from here our N is 4, R is 2, P is 1 over 6, power of 2, then 5 over 6, power of 2. So give our answer more than three significant figures, which is 1157. Then we continue. For the question B, at least. So the number of dice at least means more than equal to. So of course, if we see more than equal to, we were referring to the table. But the problem is our probability 1 over 6 is not a figure can, can be found in the table. 1 over 6 is in the decimal. 0 0.166666667. So table cannot, didn't have that value. That means for this question, we can't solve using table even if it is a more than equal reading. So in order to not solve in the table method, we have to calculate one by one. If you want to more than two means we need to start Calculating x equals to 2, x equals to 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, until maximum 4. Alright, or we can do it in reverse way, which is 1, probability maximum is 1, we minus the case it didn't happen, which is x equals to 0, and x equals to 1. Alright, so we have two options here, either you can calculate, 1 by 1, you can set one more than 2, so you calculate 2, and then 3, and then 4, maximum 4, because you only have 4 dice of it. Or you can calculate it in reverse way, means taking overall probability 1, then we minus out the case we don't want. So I will do this, opposite way. So for Px equals to 0, it will be 4, 0, 1 over 6, power 0, 5 over 6, power 4. When x equals to 1, 4, c 1, 1 over 6, power 1, 5 over 6, power 3. So figure it using calculator, 0 0.1319, you will have. Then continue for question C. Not more than. Not more than means you will be less than equal. So not more than 2. Did not be he do work. So maximum you can reach is less than equal to. So if you want to read less than equal to, I also have two options to calculate here. Whether you calculate one by one. So, which means that we calculate Px0, Px equals to 1, and Px equals to 2. You can calculate one by one, or we can do it opposite way, 
which is we minus we do one. So I take the simple working, the lesser working here, it will be doing in opposite, which is one minus we do one, which is random variable three and random variable four. We have four dice, so maximum will go until four only. So you want less than equal to I minus three and four. So either this working also can, this working also can. Alright, so we perform when we have x equals to 3 means 4c3, 1 over 6. Power 3, 5 over 6, power 1. And then 4c4, 1 over 6, power 4, 5 over 6, power 0. So figure it using your calculator. Give your answer more than three significant figures. So that's all for this question. Thank you for watching.